Hey y'all, it's Anime Game Man. Today I am going to be reviewing the first episode of Robi Hachi. And I gotta say, this episode was pretty good. Now, to preface it though, uh, the first half did start out slow, but when it got into the second half with the excitement and with the conflict, it was pretty interesting because I like how in the first half, at the very least, you introduce our characters with. In regards to Robbie, he's pretty much guy down his luck and he wants his fortune to change so he wants to and he wants to make a good amount of money and he tries to do it by investing in his business but it ends up pretty much failing but then I like how it sets up the conflict because he actually borrowed the money from shady people that want to collect it from him and I like how it, they intertwine it with the character they introduced in this episode called Hachi where he wants to pretty much work I mean not work but at the start, he wants to get some excitement, but then he ends up in a situation where he, he's against Robbie because at first he helps out Robbie get his money back. And then I like how it does some nice, subtle comedy when you have our main character, Robbie, pretty much tell Hachi that he should do something exciting and unexpected because Hachi's bored with his life, so he takes that to heart. But on notes to both of these, the first random job that Hachi finds is the job to fucking collect the money that from Robbie that he owes to this shady ass gang. And then it leads into a hilarious situation. So I kind of like that. Some good ironic humor. And I like how it sets up in a situation where the gang goes after these after Robbie, but then Hachi decides to join Robbie's side because he likes the random shit. He doesn't like to leave a, lead a life that's predictable anymore. And then I like how it just ends up in the situation where they fucking transform into these two uh, machines that fucking fuse together as if like it was a mega sword. And then it ends on a cliffhanger where they're ready to fight this, um, this gigantic ship. And I thought it was a good setup, honestly. And it had some good chuck, especially when Hachi's like, why am I in the bottom? When you have Robbie at the top, so all in all, I found from a story standpoint, it, I found it to be relatively interesting. With the first half kind of being dull, but the second half some in some good jokes here and there. And with the way it was set up, episode two for sure is going to be the do or die episode because you're going to have the giant robot fight. So cannot wait to see where that leads. Hopefully they do it well or at least funny. And as for the characters themselves, they didn't stand up too much but then again it's the first episode the only thing we got is their goals where Robbie wants to get money and Hachi wants to feel some excitement so that was about it we only got some decent amount of characterization and Robbie likes to hang out with women and all that and in the past he's been swindled by them financially and he has a lot of bad luck which I guess to a certain extent that's kind of good in the episode because at the very least it makes you kind of want to root for Robbie and then with Hachi, the one thing we learn is that he's a guy with like a nice background where he was really smart, he studied, he knows fighting skills, and he just works jobs not that he graduated from college at an early age. So at least it gives you enough background on these characters where they pretty much give information about themselves naturally. So I'd say from a writing standpoint, it's relatively decent. Although at the start there was some obvious exposition when the main character was talking about his life, which I believe it would have made sense if he would have talked about his life with like a different character or with the guy that was serving him burgers instead of just him monologuing it at the start. But that's probably the only weakness about this episode when it comes to the writing because aside from the first half, the second half had fun, nice, hilarious situations like there was a sequence where the ship wasn't starting, but then it starts, and it's hilarious because the robot tells the main character that he told Robbie, and then it actually works, and it proves the robot completely wrong. And I thought the joke worked because throughout the episode, the the robots of Robbie's been right, right, and then for Robbie to be right for once, it was kind of satisfying. And then in the random sequence, when they find like these two jets that can transform into like this giant robot at a fucking normal was also a nice bit of randomness and that's why I thought from a story and character standpoint it did relatively well animation could have used a bit work a bit of work though so for animation fans you might wanna you might this might be a bit of an entry for you which I mean there's no issue with that I'm just giving you all the heads up 
Art was decent, and I'd say overall, well, the amount of times this anime has made me laugh. I was originally going to rate it at 7 out of 10, but because of that robot transformation, I'm going to rate it at 8 out of 10. I thought it was above average, and for anyone that wants to see an anime that's um, got some giant robot references with like a sci-fi space setting, then I'd say check it out. I, I relatively enjoyed it, and I cannot wait to see more on the when it comes to the second episode. So anyways, guys and gals, this is my thoughts on the first episode of Robi Hachi. Comment down your thoughts in the comments section below about the episode and how you felt. Rate the video, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later if you subscribe for more. All right, thank you so much for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.